It's funny how three little words have the ability to completely change your life. No, I'm not talking about those three magical words, that coveted phrase, I love you. I'm talking about three little words that have the ability to completely destroy you and change your life. You have cancer. I was diagnosed on October 28, 2009. I was 23. I'd found a lump in my right breast about a year before and had been going for regular checkups with my doctor and having ultrasounds. I was assured numerous times that everything was fine and that I had nothing to worry about. Obviously, everything wasn't fine. From that moment on, I felt as if my world was moving at warp speed while I stayed still, standing in the exact same place. After my initial biopsy, I was scheduled for a sentinel node biopsy. They cut out your lymph nodes to see if the cancer has spread, and for a skin-sparing mastectomy of my right breast with an immediate latissimus dorsiflap reconstruction and nipple and areolar reconstruction. Basically, they rebuilt my boob from muscle in my back and gave me a new nipple made from skin off my back. I now like to joke that my boobs are bionic and government issue. I will continue taking tamoxifen for a total of five years or until my oncologist tells me that I don't have to anymore. I know that previous cancer research helped me to respond as well as I did to my treatment, and much of that progress was made possible thanks to donors like you. Almost two years later, I have been cancer-free for seven months, and I am still relatively the same Leah I was before I was diagnosed. I did have to withdraw from my university classes in the fall semester, which set my future goals and plans back. But I'm a trooper, and I'm looking forward to applying to law schools across the country. I volunteer for the Alberta Cancer Foundation trying to raise breast awareness. I speak at different events, telling people to check themselves and to be persistent. A lot of people see breast cancer as an older person's cancer, but I say cancer doesn't discriminate. It doesn't matter how old or young you are. It affects so many people in so many different ways. Being diagnosed as young as I was has shown me that there are some things in life you can't control, and more importantly, it has shown me all the people in this world who love and support me. At the end of the day, I wouldn't trade what happened to me for anything in the world because of what I learned and took away from my experience. Remember, always check your boobs. Join me on March 24th, 2012, and we can bust a move together.